Del Ripley, like all these men, has found a new lease of life. After years of suffering painful ulcers on his legs, they finally healed. I said to my wife, go upstairs and get my shoes. I want to go and stand outside. And my wife reminded me, I didn't even have a pair of shoes in the house. We'd given them to charity because I was told I would be in a wheelchair. And that's the best they could offer me. So what cured Dell's legs after more than a decade of problems? Well, it was a traditional African remedy using ordinary sugar. The impact of ordinary sugar on these wounds can be extraordinary. This is a typical patient before treatment. As you can see, these ulcers on his leg are extremely painful. There's a nasty smell associated with the flesh, and they've been like this for more than 13 years. And this is the same patient after treatment. And as you can see, the ulcers have almost completely gone. This patient is now back walking, driving, and even swimming. For the man behind the treatment, after years of research, he believes he has the proof the NHS needs to introduce it as a standard treatment. The good thing is that uh, I have uh, managed to do a, a randomized control trial and the statistical results show that there is a significance in the use of sugar on wounds. And for Dell, his new lease of life includes spreading the word about his treatment. After some of the stories I've listened to, i.e., such as an 83-year-old lady on the phone to me yesterday morning for 40 minutes, crying her heart out in desperation for the treatment. I don't know whether it's possible, but I want to get this treatment for as many people as I can. More access to this treatment would be pretty sweet. David Gregory Kumar, BBC Northwest Tonight.